my whole thing is this i am a bit concerned about these lawmakers i don't understand them what is up youtube what's cool what's cool what's happening back to you with another mukbang hashtag struggle mukbang um yeah we got the same sweet potato fries from iceland i think they're two pounds and we've got these crunchy fake kfc looking things um i don't remember how much they were i think three pound for like a whole bag and then my favorite my mayonnaise my tomato ketchup and i got honey now i need to talk to you guys about things you know how sometimes you think things that are more expensive are better right this te this honey here is from tesco set honey and i think it's one pound fifty and then this honey here is a supposedly limited edition scottish scottish heather honey it is a rounded caramel like balance of nutty ling heather i don't know if it's heather or heather but this is what it is and sweet floral bell heather whatever the heck that is but yeah here it is it's about the same amount of honey and it is a whopping five pounds because here's the thing i used to put this one with my coffee and somehow it has this set honey has a different kind of flavor it's not just very sweet it has like kind of a caramelly type flavor and i would put it in my coffee and then take it in my thermos situation and then go about my business so i would feel like i have my own kind of it had this caramelly vanilla -y flavor and i would think that that's kind of like having starbucks or something like that right because they always add like flavorings and stuff into their things now i'm gonna put this honey on the side here because i've been seeing people eating their chicken with honey yeah so i was like okay um i'm gonna buy a nicer honey which would cost me about the same amount as one starbucks drink because you can look at it that way too i don't spend money on things like starbucks anyway let's pray god have a father thank you for this food I pray it tastes very good. Maybe there's other people who don't have it. And maybe there's those who contribute to this food in this making of it. Amen. So yeah. Um I, I always see people they're they're going to Starbucks and this and that. I don't do that. Sometimes I I do, you know, I was like, okay, it wouldn't be bad to spend a little cash on this thing and make my things taste nice. Let me tell you, the cheaper honey was better. Much better. This other honey. Mm -mm -mm. They do. And then you think you are being bougie, so you buy the expensive one. Hmm. But it's not compared to the one, the low price one. Hmm. It's all for you. And they give the thing a very funny name. And I other not by you were asking me why I was eating from this thing. <laughs> why you were eating from the tree? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you said the, the tree you are going to wash. If you take a plate, you are going to wash. So. Yeah, now I have a plate anyway because the way this thing is set up, I don't want things to be dropping on the flow. Hmm. Let me check them. It's as fake news as it gets. Mm -hmm. You can eat this for days. Wash them well, put them in bath, you like label them, put them in the fridge. You don't want to go and take season it good. Or season it beforehand. Mm, I don't really do it like that, but when it goes, it goes into the and you bring it out, somebody sees it is cool with, with the ice and so on. So, mm. when I bring it out, then I season it mm -hmm. fresh and nice. You need to tell the people why it's important to wash your chicken. Wait, right, me, I wash my chicken very, very well. Hmm. Very, very well. Hmm. Very well. First, I use the uh, vinegar. Vinegar. Wash it, wash it good. Mm -hmm. That's the first one. Second, wash with lime. Wash it, wash it good. Third, wash with lime. And sometimes, you need some of the lime on it. Mm. Take the scent away. Sometimes it smells like a uh, fat mm. chicken fat. All oh, the scent is gone. And it's so nice. What I'm trying to figure out is how some people out here, you know who you are. Don't wash your chicken and don't season it. Mm. Why would I want my chicken to taste like a farm? Mm -hmm. It really tastes like a, like a farm. Mm. You don't want to. They're gonna have protests in France, isn't it? Yeah, it's a very big protest. So hmm. The trains are not running, the planes are not running. They, they say the pension, the pension will be better. So protest does something. I mean, I hope it's peaceful. And it's not always peaceful. Some people take their law into their hands, they spoil people's business and so on. It doesn't make sense. My whole thing is this. I am a bit concerned about these lawmakers. I don't understand them. They have it good. 
they're kind of brilliant. Not to say that it's easy, an easy job, because all these people have bags under their eyes like you have never seen. And we applaud them. Like, it's it's not easy. They need to know a lot. They're very smart people. They need to know a lot. And they always need to be on their toes. Somebody will just come out of nowhere. So, what are you going to do about this? Like, they always need to be ready. Ready to defend yourself. But I don't get it. Pension age should be 50. Oh, 50 is too small. They no. should be realistic. 50, they say no one will be crying. 50 is too small. No, it's not. And sometimes you still wonder, they're not bad. Well, so this is what should happen. It should be. But this is the age that you can go please. It should be about 55. Then people can enjoy life before they die. If you're doing construction oh, work, Mm -hmm. Most people in the hospitals are there with illnesses from like 50, mm. chronic ones. I say 50. Make it a choice. If you are a cleaner, 50 is okay. Yeah, that's. I used to have teachers that were like 60 and that. These people, sometimes I would look at them and I'd say, by you, are you okay? <laughs> They're like their mental is even gone. Sorry to say, like they started acting strange. She just mentioned that, like, what would you do? This is where the problem comes. What will you do? Mm. So the whole society, everyone needs to be structured differently. But the sad thing is, eh? they say, oh, they saw pension aid seventy, pension aid. 85 me i'm just saying something they say all these things but here's the thing it can't be for everybody and that's why it should be optional the actual pension age should be maybe the age of 65 wow but some people will be go at it so they really enjoy the life there are people that i've known for decades that have been on pension for all those decades <laughs> i've never known them to work and they're living the life see this guy yeah, they are complaining that they are the young people the young people Job. So that is all people can see someone if they Bye. go on pension so that I can get a job. That is it. They are still there. Say they have experience and then they get some school. They put their experience in. They, they, they don't get the jobs. They are still hanging around. That is all people who just fall and die and all their expertise is born with them. What is nice about that? That's a good question. Left about that. Hmm. No, but no lie, some of them taste like patrols in there somewhere. Mm. They are so strong and like just offensive. Like honey, especially like like when you look at all them the, the cartoons and stuff we used to watch at kid as kids. Oh here comes the the bear and the bear is just eating this honey and it's made to look so sweet and it's golden. The stuff is golden. Okay. Now come and see this thing. The thing that I just showed you, that thing is brown. Oh, and, so, is also, and so and so thick. Here's what needs to happen. Okay, so here we're gonna talk about the pension age reducing. Probably, probably need to trial this on a few generations, and I suggest my own. Mm -hmm. So what are you eating? Fake KFC. <laughs> Sweet potato fries and cucumbers. Uh, cucumbers are so good. I hadn't had cucumbers in months. That thing is good. I was watching this mukbang called Be Loves Life, and she always has cucumber, and she says it's so refreshing. She wasn't lying, man. Cucumber is the best. It's so, mm, it's crunchy. Mm. It's gonna be juicy too. Oh, it's so good. It's actually good on its own, and then it's good with food as well. What was I talking about? Yes, we need to do the whole society thing different. Let's. Reverse. Okay, we need to get it back. Everybody go on pension at age 55, but you can stay for as long as you want. That's up to you. Yeah, that's it. Before that's one, that was how it was. Because there'll be a lot of people that will go but and after two months be like, yeah, this life is boring. I'm coming back. Or people that are just like, nah, I don't have anything to do after 55. So people don't have a family. Work is their, that's their life. So they would stay on. The people that are construction workers, cleaners, and heck, probably even nurses, we like, we hoodie. I'm out of this place. Like, I'm gone. And it's better for them because, yeah. They're and then again. we would save so much on like healthcare. Most of these people work themselves to the bone till they get ill. And then now we have these people that are 65 plus. They've just gone on pension and they're in the hospital. Mm. I can tell you how many times I've seen that. Just went on pension. Just about to go on pension. They're like, body breaks down. It's like, nope. Mm. I'll make you suffer. Mm. And they come and lie down and some of them don't even come back home anymore. Mm -hmm. What is nice about that? I don't know, man. I don't get it too. They should really, really do 
things, reverse everything. So are you making the moon bang? Yeah. So what we are saying is carrying on the moon bang. Not everything, but yeah. Ah. And nobody sees what you're eating because it's a lot. You're hiding the food. No, they can see it. It's up there. Oh. <clears throat> if you hide it, it's not a moon bang. They need to see what you're eating. Mm, fake chicken. Ah. But it doesn't taste good. Tastes weird. Tastes like yum. It tastes like I don't even know how to explain it. I don't throw food away, so here we are. But yeah, we're gonna start doing healthier mukbangs. Mm. Once all this is finished, of course, because we can't throw food away. Man needs to lose weight and tone for the holiday season. You know what it is. Surprise! That's the end of this video. This is the part in which we talk about the pension thing. We're gonna continue to talk about some other things which you will see in the next upcoming days. But leave a comment down below what you thought about the things that we discussed in this video. I love to read your comments because let me know what y'all think. So yeah, please go ahead and do that. Make sure to tap that like button, hit the pump stop as well as the subscribe button and hit the notification bell whilst you're at it. See you in the next one. But in the meantime, share this video with everybody you know. God bless. Oh, and make time for glorious life. It's time to start with living it right.